welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a tricky question that many users encounter when working with grep. Our viewer is trying to filter out specific lines from a file, but they're running into some issues with their rejects. Let's dive into the details of their question. How can we escape the backslash in grep to successfully remove lines containing a specific directory path? Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get to that resolution. Now, let's get on to the video. Let's start by understanding the issue with your grep command. You want to remove lines that contain the directory path h check. The problem lies in how the backslash is treated in the command line. In many shells, the backslash is an escape character. This means you need to escape it properly. To fix your command, you should modify the regex to escape the backslashes correctly. The updated command should look like this. Now, when you run this corrected command, it should successfully remove the lines containing the specified directory path. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. When using grep, you don't need to include the sto characters. Grep automatically searches for your phrase. For example, searching for he in a line like hi there will return the whole line without needing its stro he. The way you escape backslashes in grep depends on the type of quotes you use. With single quotes, use two backslashes like slash check. With double quotes, you need three backslashes to escape correctly. If you choose not to use quotes, you'll need four backslashes. The first escapes the second, the third escapes the fourth, leaving two for grep to evaluate correctly. Experiment with grep to discover its full capabilities. It can handle a wide range of searches and more, as long as you know the syntax. And that's it, guys. I hope that video helped find the resolution you're looking for. If it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you could hit subscribe. Until the next time you need more technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.